E3, excellent education for everyone. Leaders in urban education reform. Is there anything that you'd like to say to anyone about uh, this organization, E3? And um, I'm quite sure that you heard about the OSA bill that us trying to get passed. Can you speak a little bit about that? Well, I mean, I, I, our organization, uh, the Black Alliance for Educational Options, we support all of the options uh, for low income and working class black people. And we believe that the Opportunity Scholarship ought to be one of the things that gets passed uh, in New Jersey so that it can uh, positively impact uh, those young people who need that type of option. And so as far as we're concerned, the more options, the better, uh, given the gravity of the educational problems that are facing our young people. We must have radical change because far too many of our children are not being served by our current systems of education. They don't do well on various forms of assessments. Their schooling gives them pathways to the lowest rung of America's ladder of success. Their parents are unhappy, uninvolved, unempowered. Their school environments physically and mentally are structured in ways that devalue them as people and are contemptuous of the communities from where they come. And when they don't learn, they and their families are blamed. And so what's happening, man, all over the world, man, every day when the sun comes up, young people start running. And young people all over the world, man, is running faster than our best young people. And if they're running faster than our best young people, what chance are we going to have if we can't read, write, think, compute, analyze? You know, France for now, a revolutionary wrote a book called Wretched of the Earth. And he said, every generation out of relative obscurity must discover its mission and either fulfill it or betray it. I believe our mission, man, is to educate this next generation of young people in ways that we've never done before. Because the world that they're living in now requires that. Is there anything that you'd like to say to the people that may get this uh, message tonight? of um, them being influenced or just the families that may want to take a second thought about how they should get involved in this? Well, I mean, I, I just think that if people think that the education systems are meeting our needs, then I guess you don't do anything. But if, but if you think that it's not, and you think that the young people, um, our children, our grandchildren, our relatives, if you think they need a better situation than what they've got, then you got to get out and get, and, and get engaged in trying to make changes that are going to benefit them. Now, if you think everything is cool, then there's no need to be involved. But if you really think, as I do, that we have a really crisis uh, on our hands, then it's very important for all of us to get engaged in this struggle.